Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It is episode four, and we're going to try to continue our playthrough of the uh, Edward Castle, or Edward's Prison, or I guess it is the Edward's Castle Prison. Uh, <laughs> as you kind of noticed in the last episode, or if you're watching the live stream this past Thursday, we kind of lost power, which cut a few things out. We technically still had internet, but uh, I found out the hard way that the Switch that sits between my computer and the cable modem is not hooked up to a battery backup. So uh, that, that got cut off a little prematurely. Fortunately, uh, I was able to save the game state before everything, before needing to shut everything down because, you know, the battery backup's just there for a very, very short time and a lot shorter than what, uh, what, we, need, what, we, what we would have needed for power to get restored. So that does mean that we're able to pick up right where we left off, where we were examining our lives in the dingy cell, looking at the, uh, looking, looking at the moss, looking at the, the ball and chain, and our flute started talking to us. Nothing weird about that. <sighs> Nothing weird at all. And, um, uh, it, it appears to be the spirit of our father. Yep. Still, still trying to get used to that one. My talking flute. And he has something that he wants to ask of me. So do we want to listen and go, yes, if it's your wish or no, you deserted me. Um, I I'm thinking more along the lines of, sure, why not? I want you to save me. Okay. I too was once held in the cell. Look at the left hand wall. This? Have you heard anything from Grandpa Bill? Grandpa? He was an architect. Your grandpa knows the secret of that stone. The secret? Starting now, you will encounter a terrible thing. Should, should I be thanking you for this? There we go. Thank you. Do I have to? Pick up the stone your enemy left. The power of the crystal is contained there. That power will prove to be your ally. You must make a pilgrimage to the ruins of the world to find the mystic statues. The closer you get to the crystal, the stronger the evil power will be. Well, no time. Quickly. First, to the Incan ruins. The flute's voice fades and disappears. Dramatically. Okay, sorry. So, we picked up... Oink, oink. Oh! Hey! It's Bacon! I, I mean, it, it's, uh... What was the pig's name? I already forgot the pig's name. It's locked. I wonder if this is Kara's pig. What luck! There's a letter and a key tied to its tail. The letter reads, Sorry to hear that you're in prison. Dear Anon. We need the, uh, oh, what was that, that sweet, uh, violin that, you know, everybody likes to play in the tender moments, the, uh, oh. Uh, I'll remember it at some point. Probably many episodes passed when I really needed it. Uh, sorry to hear that you're in prison. It's terrible what my father's done, but hear what I have to say. I too am a prisoner, in a prison of silk and gold. Listen, lady. Silk and gold beat this moss and rock any day. But tonight I will leave the castle forever. You also will be free. You have the key. Dun dun dun. Yay. Okay. So, oh. Uh, nope. That, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to get to. There we go. Items. 
we've equipped the uh we've equipped the key as he turns the prison key the steel door opens with a dull sound that sounds like <laughs> that actually sounds like the sound that was used in uh chrono trigger when <laughs> when you try to get that squared away uh you know recycling sounds and all that Hello? Is there anybody here? I don't need anyone's help. I can get out by myself. Um. Are you sure? Be free. Like, the door's open. Okay, fine. Hey, a save game. That would have been useful. You know, right before the power went out. <clears throat> I am Gaia, the source of all life. I'll give you some advice. When you defeat all the enemies in an area, you will get a jewel that increases your abilities. Push the start button to see the locations of your enemies. Ooh, that could be useful. Find the demons and defeat them. Record what's happened so far? Yes, please. <laughs> Finished recording. Continue your journey? Yes, please. Then go. Okay, so now that we've saved our game and I feel a little bit better about life, we're back to Edward's prison. Uh, no, start is just giving me pause. I mean, not giving me pause, but giving me pause. You know what I mean. Okay. So, let me make sure that I'm not missing any of the gems, because there are supposed to be three gems in the prison. Um, yeah, I know. What What are three gems doing in the prison? I don't know. All right. Uh, anything in there? No. In there? No. In there? No. Something I can move? No. Okay. And all the way to the south and prepare to... Oh, now we prepare to fight. On guard. Okay. So far, so good. I'm beating them down with a flute. Your hit point has increased. Ooh. When you defeat all of the enemies around you, a jewel will appear. There we go. Alright, so that, this is our first attack. It's supposed to be a... You hit the direction you're facing after the attack and if you're fast enough you can uh, hit them twice with it but one of the interesting quirks of the game is that while that animation is playing and you're doing that leap attack forward you're actually safe from attack so you can block attacks by using the telekinesis uh, the left and right or right shoulder buttons and that that will block incoming attacks as long as you actually hit it with a flute which is weird but okay um especially since that's a purple flute the only purple flutes i made of are made by companies that uh make flute shaped objects but that's neither here nor there that's more my day job than anything else uh, but anyway so the other thing you can do is while you're fighting if you do a lot of those leap attacks while you're doing the leap animations you are technically immune from damage uh, mostly it's because the game can't register the hits while you're going through the animation so it's more of a, a quirk of the game than anything I would call um, a, an actual feature I mean we're going to use it as a feature but there we go hello all right, what else we got down here? More bats. So far, so good. We're making our way down New Valley pretty well. I mean, there's all the easy battles that you shouldn't be losing. Oh. Is that a switch? No, that's not a switch. So far, so good, all right. Uh-oh. Well, that doesn't look good. 
None of that looks good. Alright. Oh, hey, hey, I, I didn't mean to let you out, Bones. I'll take that, though. Okay. I guess that works. I'm not dead yet. And fight! Fight! Pick up all the gems. Okay. Oh, so here we go. Here's, here's the new pause menu. So, this screen... Very elegantly <laughs> rendered, and uh, uh, I'm sorry that this was actually kind of poor for the SNES days. Th this is more uh, classic NES than uh, Super Nintendo graphics, but okay. Uh, so it looks like there are four enemies still remaining. I'm not sure what that force thing flashing is. Um, I, I don't hear any voices going, use the force. So, uh, of course, that's a different franchise, so maybe it's something else. But, uh, definitely see we got four more guys coming up on the other side. Oh, hi! Urf. That didn't quite go as planned. I, I didn't intend to take a hit on that one. Oop. Let's see if we can... And block! Ooh! Your strength has increased! Sweet. Okay. <laughs> Just checking. You can't actually walk off the ledge. Alright. Uh, ta -ta. There's a second break in the railing. So. Alright. Just double checking because I want to make sure that there's no gems here. Step in front of the railing, strike, yada yada. Now head south. You're now at a fork in the road. Okay, sure. Oh wait, no, we're not there yet. Let's head down this way. Can I pull the bat towards me? No? Okay. I'll take that. Ooh. There we go. Alright, so we got this way up here. Nope. I guess we're still pretty linear through the, uh... Down the way. We got about 13 guys and one item. What? What are you? What are you? Oop. That works. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, what are you doing? You're getting in my way. Give me that. Uh, okay. I, oh, yeah, that's right. I don't think there's anything I can do about those guys. Let's just uh, make our way through here. Give me that. Get over here. Oh, wrong franchise. Alright, so we got that to the south. And hello, Bones. Oh, I have actually taken a little bit of damage. I need to keep an eye on the health bar up there. see there we 
we go. Oh. Ooh. Your defense has increased. Okay, but I'm not sure I'm ready to go through there yet, because uh, I deeply suspect that I'm missing whatever is down this away. Ooh, hello. You found an herb. Hello, herb. Really? Okay. Um. Got that. Break it three times. Skeleton. Tentacle eyes. New passage. Strength. Okay. Go to the northwest. Got that. Head back down. Kill the skeleton. Make the switch. Get the herb. Okay, no gems yet. I know there's three in here. And this is like the, the stupid little um, camera thing in Portal where <laughs> if you miss it, guess what? You missed it. It's gone. It's done. All right, because there's, uh, there's no going back. Didn't time that one, right? All right. Come on. Give me that thing. There we go. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. There's the shadows. Okay. Uh, so the spears do give you a very nice shadow that lets you know that they're coming. Very helpful. I could, I could really use a uh, one of the portal thingies to save. I. Oh yeah. Dodging, weaving. Oh, oh come on. Oh oh oh! This is about to be bad. Come on. It won't go in. Maybe it's rusty. Uh, huh. Yeah, this is about to look... This is about to be bad, isn't it? For some reason, I thought those... Th uh, oh, I'll take that. All right. Where does this go? There we go. Good. It's that save point I was looking for. You found a red jewel. Well, since we have the red jewel, let's go ahead and let's uh, send that jewel over to Jim. So that's the first of three. And now here's the really neat thing. We can go in. Come on. When you defeat the enemies, a shiny silver dark gem will appear. If you collect 100 of these, you gain one life. Even if you're defeated, you won't have to go back very far. Oh, I thought you were portal. Okay. Uh, okay. So those little gems that we've been picking up all along. Uh, we, we get 100 of those, and then we'll be able to... Uh, <laughs> Not go as far back as we as we feared. All right. Um, restore strength. No. Okay. What do I want to have here? Actually, let me have that equipped. All right. Just double checking. Yeah, I'm down to my last three hit points. All right, let's make him count. I thought there was going to be a safe spot there. 
I know there's one coming up soon. Oh! That's a lot of bats. Okay. Alright, so far so good. Oop. Gotcha. Oh, they, they seem to follow the same path. That would have been... There we go. Nothing there. No more bad guys. Well, given that we're about 20 minutes into the episode, this is actually where I'm going to go ahead and say thank you for joining along so far. If you're watching live on Twitch, hang tight. There's still a little bit more to come. There's a few ways you can help out. If you haven't already, follow on Twitch. That way you'll get notified when I go live. I stream almost every Tuesday and Thursday at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern, and I may do the odd extra stream on the weekend like this go-round. So follow along and you'll always know. Subscribe on YouTube if you haven't already. That way you'll know when new episodes, live stream archives, and various other bits get posted. You've heard all this before, so I won't belabor things about, you know, like buttons and bells and things. And yeah, you know how all that works. And support the show. I'm pretty much running this thing out of my back pocket, so if you're enjoying the content and getting a little value out of it, then uh, consider going to live.anonjunior.com. That'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, uh, however however you want to think about that, and give a little value back. Again, it's just one; it's a value for value proposition. So if you're getting a little bit of value out of this, be it entertainment or knowledge or whatever then consider giving a little back at live.anonjunior.com. That'll take you to the Streamlabs page. There should also be a link in the description somewhere, too. And even if it's just enough for a fresh cup of coffee, keep, keeping me in coffee goes a long way to helping out. So thank you, live folks. Give me a minute to prep the next episode. And uh, YouTube folks, I'll see you tomorrow.